Hi, my name is Jamie Prickett. I am the co-founder and CEO of Xperia Financial Group. I'm excited to share with you a bunch of information that hopefully you'll take away some nuggets today. So to start off with, when my wife and I started Xperia, it was actually launched in Canada in 2014. We worked in Canada up until around 2019 when we had this crazy idea that we wanted to go to the United States of America. Now at that time we were already becoming a large player in Canada, but we weren't as big as we are today. As of the recording of this video, which is December 2019. 23 we're actually the sixth largest IMO in the Canadian market space but four years ago we decided to go into the US of A well as many of you know about four years ago is when the pandemic hit everyone really hard that slowed down a lot of our plans so it took us about two years to get our feet under us to get ourselves established and through that time we developed some amazing relationships with partner companies some leaders in the industry and we've now managed to grow to over 1400 licensed agents in the US of A what's super exciting for us is we are still a baby but we have a powerful backing of a Canadian operation and for the first time in the IMO industry there is an independent IMO that operates on both sides of the border now when I say an independent IMO, I'm talking about a real IMO, where you have real contractual ownership of your business. You have the opportunity with Xperia to build your business in all 50 states that we operate, but also in the provinces that we operate, which is all the Canadian provinces as well. Our vision is that we continue to grow globally. We have plans and intentions over the next several years to expand into Mexico, into Philippines, Vietnam, and many other countries. So our exciting platform, we call it a tribrid. And a tribrid is where we actually looked at the three different models in our industry. And it's no different in Canada as it is in the United States of America. You've got your career or your captive agencies. You've got your independent or your IMO agencies. And then you've also got your multi-level marketing or network marketing type agencies. Some are a combination of two. Most of them are singular and they have one of those kind of attributes attached to them. Now, there's positives in all of them. When we talk about the career or the captive agencies, we're talking about companies that provide a ton of support, hand-holding, onboarding. They're really great at helping the newest person in the industry get themselves established. Then we look at the independent or the IMO. In a lot of cases, there's not a ton of training other than maybe what carriers or wholesalers with the insurance companies will provide them. But there's a lot of positives in the sense of the independence, right? You have access to multiple carriers. Nobody owns you. And then the third one is the network marketing or the multi-level marketing MLM. And that's where you have the ability to grow distribution by recruiting agents. You can grow all across the country and in many cases provide equal opportunity to people that are joining. Now, the challenges with these three models, number one is the lack of opportunity for growth in the career model, right? A lack of access to multiple carriers in the career model and the lack of ownership in the career model. When we look at the IMO or the independent, it's typically the lack of training, sometimes the lack of transparency, right? I know that most IMOs today, if you want to leave them, they will hold you hostage for six months and in some case two years, even though they claim that you own your business things of which Xperia does not do. We have immediate release. Um, but nonetheless, the IMO, some of the negatives can be that lack of training and lack of transparency. On the MLM side, a lot of the negativity comes in the stigma attached to it and the low compensation. A lot of agents realize really quick after working with one of these companies that, man, if I go to an independent IMO, I can make a lot more money. So yes, I want to recruit and build a team and live the dream, but I can't pay my bills along the way. So a lot of people look to get out of that uh, and that's why the turnover is so horrendous. What we did when we launched Xperia is we knew that there was good in all three of these models. So we simply took the best from all three models, left the rest and created what we believe to be the first of its kind in our tribrid model, Xperia Financial Group. Now, one thing that we also talk a lot about is something with the acronym BTO, which stands for Brand, Timing, and Ownership. 
Now, to touch on the brand for a second, this is one thing that I know to be true about the industry. You want to have a good brand backing you. The company I came from, it kind of had America in its name and it had a really negative connotation. It was a multi-level marketing, one of the largest. And every time I would say the name of the company, people would roll their eyes at me and go, oh gosh, I heard about you guys. We never want to build a brand like that. So we want to protect our brand. And we make sure that our brand is not just that of, hey, we sell life insurance. Hey, we sell annuities. Hey, we do all that stuff. We do Medicare. I mean, we do it all. But our brand is a brand of helping people. I love the fact that our agents are so willing to put other people first and this is one of the attributes that I see in our great leadership team. It's character integrity. I think that it's easy to go out there and run a mess and just sell a bunch of crap policies, whatever is the quickest thing that you can sell, but our agents truly take time. We do financial analysis for our clients. We actually find out what is in the best interest of our clients. We don't specialize in final expense or mortgage protection or IUL. We specialize in everything. Life insurance. If you're a life insurance agent, you should know how all of the products work, not just one or the other. So we're super proud of our team for that. But that's our brand that we want to continue to establish as a good player in the marketplace. Then we talk about timing. Timing is absolutely critical. When you think about timing, you know, think about the company that you're with right now. And imagine you could have been at some of the boardroom meetings when they were just getting started, before they turned into thousands, maybe tens of thousands of agents. Would your opportunity have been different if you were there at the ground floor versus joining them after 20, 30, 40, 50 years maybe? Absolutely. Well, we are at the absolute ground floor, but the beautiful thing is we have the powerhouse of Xperior Canada as our backing company as we've blown up in the States and done some amazing things. The last part is ownership. Now, ownership of your book of business exists with most real IMOs, but what doesn't exist and what actually bothers me a little bit is ownership of an agency. See, I talk to agents every single day from the US of A, and a lot of them call themselves agency owners. When they have a downline team of agents, they're an upline to them, they think that they're agency owners. But here's the sad truth. You don't have a contract stipulating that you're an agency owner, you're not an agency owner. See, an agency owner means this, if you die, your business can be willed to your family. Not just your book of business, that's a no-brainer. Carriers pay you direct, you die, your book of business, you can leave it to someone as long as they get a license in a certain period of time, that's great. But what about your agency? What if you develop a team of 10, 20, 30, 1,000, 10,000 agents in your organization? What happens if you die? See, Xperia is the only company that I have found that has a contractual ownership where you are guaranteed a buyout on your business regardless if your beneficiary is licensed or not, regardless if they're appointed with any of the carriers or not, regardless if they have any state licenses or not. This is absolutely huge how we've built this. And the way it works is when someone becomes an executive director with us, which I'll talk to you about that in a minute, as an executive director, you have a team of at least seven producing agents. You now have the ability, if you die, to transfer your business, your agency, your team, to a beneficiary, that code gets transferred, they continue to get paid 75% contractually and guaranteed for the next 10 years. That's a seven and a half times buyout. Once you're an executive director, you now have the right to promote other executive directors. When you do that, this further grows your distribution and now you can actually build to the point where you have indefinite payouts. Our gold legacy program will pay 25% indefinitely after the initial 10 years at 75. Our platinum legacy payout is 50% indefinitely. That means your beneficiary, when you pass on, has to have another beneficiary form signed with our company because it's gonna continue from one generation to the next. Imagine leaving a true legacy for your family. And last but not least is Platinum Plus. We've already had four people qualify in our organization for Platinum Plus over the last seven years. And guess what, ladies and gentlemen, Platinum Plus guarantees contractually that your beneficiaries are gonna receive 75% of everything that you've built forever. Absolutely phenomenal.
So now you might be wondering, how do I become an executive director? Well, there's different stages. First of all, if someone is brand new to the industry, I mean, they don't even know how to close a door. We really gotta babysit them, handhold them, teach them the ropes, show them everything. We start them at a 70% contract. Now, we have a commission grid, which if you talk to the person that shared this video with you, they can share with you, every product pays out differently. 70% is the top product, some pay 65, some might pay 61 and a half, 62.3, 68.1. We actually do this in a different way than what I've seen the industry as a whole does. We look at what the gross that comes into Xperior and we pay out based on that. So every time Xperior gets a raise, our entire sales force gets a raise. So we have a live document on our back office that shows our comp grids at the various levels and how it goes, and if it goes up, our comp goes up, agent's comp goes up, which by the way has happened quite a bit over the last couple of years as our volume has grown exponentially. Now, our starting contract is 70%. Again, that's posted rate, some falls under that depending on the product. Give you an example, an IUL starting contract would be about 63% on average. So it's about 90% factor of the 70% grid. That said, our starting contract 70% beats all the other IMOs 70% contracts. Why? Because of transparency. Whatever we get, it's a percentage of that that goes out to the sales force. We keep about 10% as a corporation to run the corporation. The rest of it is all paid to the sales force, regardless of how big or small that carrier contract may be. So 70% to start. After about five sales, typically, you're promoted to a senior financial associate position, which is an 85% contract. You don't have to recruit anyone to do that. Then you can become a senior manager. There's two ways to do it. You can start building a team or you can do it on your personal production. A senior manager is a 100% contract, but the senior manager contract, there's actually three different, a few different levels to it. You can actually go from a senior manager at 100% up to 107.5%, up to 115%, then some additional bonuses up to 120, 125, and 130. What's super exciting about our model, it's one of the few models in the industry where you don't have to recruit anybody, but you can still reach the highest contract in our company. Now, when you're a builder, when you become a senior manager, you can continue to move up the senior manager track on your production, or you can go from senior manager to executive director by whereas you, whereas you would have seven producing agents in your business, you have to do 30,000 of submitted premium two months in a row, and now you're at 115% contract minimum, and it goes up to 130 with some of the bonuses that you can earn on a month-to-month -month basis as well. The great thing about being an executive director is now you can actually promote other independent executive directors. And picture this, let's say I'm an executive director and I'm earning 115 to 130%, and I promote someone out of my agency to executive director. Now they're earning somewhere between 115 and 130%, and they're overriding their agents and so on. I will still earn 14% over and above what Xperior is paying that executive director. This actually continues for seven generations of developing executive directors. Our total grid payout is between 143 minimum up to 158%. As a matter of fact, there's even one carrier, we just don't sell a lot of this one, it actually pays a little over 160% to our entire compensation grid. We believe in being very competitive for the agents because the agents are the kings and queens of this operation. We believe that the only reason we have a great company is because we compensate people fair, we give them true ownership of their business, not only their book of business, an immediate release upon request, but also their agency as well. And the last part of ownership, which I think is one of the most important, especially when you look at this as a well-established startup in the US of A is that we give out equity in the company, but not just equity in the American company that's just been rocking and rolling for a few years now, but the mothership Xperior. You actually get to earn equity in the Canadian and the US corporation. And our dream is to see this company become one of the most powerful insurance organizations on planet Earth, not just in North America, but around the entire globe. Now, 
the last part of this message to you today is that of our leadership and our support. See, we have a technology back office like no one else. We invest literally millions of dollars annually into our technology right now. We have our own built-in CRM system. We've got quoting tools now set up with iPipeline, IXN, Annuity Rate Watch, all of these tools for you to go out and build your business. We have a scoreboard. We've got training tutorials, videos. We even now have a lead program. If you're interested in purchasing leads, we don't make one red cent on those leads. We pass the savings 100% to the agents that wanna develop that. Um, just this week, as I'm recording this video, we've got um, a three-day workshop on how to brand yourself online, how to build your own leads, if that's something that you're interested in. See, we don't make money in the lead business, we make money in the insurance business. We've got great partners. You know, if you look at the screen right now, you're gonna see a bunch of the amazing partnership companies we have we have some 40 companies that we now have access to on this next screen you're gonna see that we actually have some referral partnerships one of them is a company called debt medic that expanded from the Canadian operation into the US operation as well and now can provide phenomenal debt solutions for our clients we've also got net law we've got um, legal shield you know we, we're just we're, we're continuing to grow we've got an ERC program that we've uh, that we've been working on with some from with an accounting firm called Occam's we are looking for ways to help people go from where they are, maybe work in a career, a job they don't like, maybe they're frustrated with where they're at, show them how to transition into a full-time career with our organization. One thing I really love is that a lot of our agents are full-time. We, yes, we have a, a ton of part-time agents as well, but the majority of people that even start part-time, they quickly see how realistic it is that they can be full-time in this industry, building a great business and developing their client base. Now. I know it's great to make money, but we like to get recognized for it too. You know, I remember with my former company, I was there for 10 years before leaving and I've now been gone from there for 12 years, but 22 years total in the industry if you do the math. And one thing I really liked is, you know, if they had a contest, like I would want to win a t-shirt sometimes more than, you know, making a paycheck. That might sound silly, but I'm a, I'm a competitor. And we have trips. We have contests that people can win. You know, we, we give out swag every month. We have something called the Entrepreneur's Lounge where you can get gifts sent to your door every, every single month based on, you know, becoming a part of our Entrepreneur's Lounge as an example. We also have company trips that we do, but you can also qualify for the carrier trips. You can also qualify for carrier bonuses. Just as an example, Corbridge has a 20% bonus that you can earn on over and above your compensation that you're paid. See, anything that the carriers do, you know, if you, if you wanna run an event and you need some marketing dollars for that, we allow our agents to, to access the marketing dollars from the carriers to help them run those events so it doesn't put you out of pocket when, as you're building your team. You know the other thing that I really like that we have is we have this Super Bowl ring. This Super Bowl ring, I don't have it on me right now, you'll see it in the graphic, but I call it the Super Bowl ring, but it's a ring that we award to anyone that earns over a six-figure income. It's a solid gold ring. It's a very valuable piece, but it's also valuable in the sense that it reminds you of the people that you've impacted, the lives that you've changed, the families that you've protected, the death claims that you've paid out, the families you help retire. And I believe that six figures is not a huge income in this world today, but I do believe it's one step in the right direction. And we're at a point now where every single week, sometimes multiple times a week, we have new agents earning this six-figure ring on top of all that we want you to become an owner of Xperia so don't take lightly when I talk about owning your book of business that's important but what's even more important if you're a builder is that ownership of the agency and last but not least as I mentioned the ownership in the shares but why not get a little bit of swag along the way as well now the leadership at Xperia is something that I want to share. It is by far the single greatest attribute I think we have. We have leaders that have been in the industry for some 10, 20, some for 30 plus years. We have leaders that have come from other companies literally earning half a million, 750,000, a million dollars a year that have come from other often cases network marketing type firms in the insurance space and have joined forces with Xperia and you might ask yourself, well, why would they walk away from that? And I'll tell you why, because I think there's one quality in a leader that so many people seek after that they wish that there was someone that would just 
say what they mean and stand behind it, and that is integrity. Now, I know that a lot of people use the word integrity, and I think it's used very loosely, because I honestly believe nine out of 10 people that say, I have integrity, I have integrity, they ain't got none. Because if you have it, it shows. But I want to share one thing without at the risk of sounding cheesy or, or, or ungenuine, disingenuine. Um, I want to share with you that I believe the leadership team that we have attracted to Experior has character and integrity. And I believe the truth can take you on to do amazing things. And that's one thing that we're doing as an organization. We are transparent. We are real people. We offer real opportunity and we offer real ownership. And I hope that you'll consider coming with us on a journey to go achieve some amazing things in this marketplace. Thanks so much. Bye-bye. For more awesome content, like and subscribe now. We are the Icebreakers team. Our team writes more business per license agent than any other Experior Financial Group team in both the U.S. and Canada. We are also the fastest growing team within Experior Financial Group in both the USA and Canada. We have full modern training in English, Spanish, and French. For more information on how to power up your life insurance business through joining the Icebreakers team of champions, contact the person that sent you this video or scan the QR code. Thank you for watching and see you next time.